Fox News Channel, and this is big. We are now getting word that FBI officials have just arrested a man from Massachusetts who they say was plotting to attack the Pentagon and the U.S. Capitol. Let's get live to the Pentagon and Jennifer Griffin with details. Jennifer, what do we know here? Hello there. Recent developments have seen the jazz world split in two by a new wave of musicians calling themselves disc jockeys. Those in favor describe the phenomena as a fresh rush of blood in the aging corpse of music. Those against prefer the term Emperor's New Clothes. Tonight you may judge for yourselves as we bring you the propeller heads who together with the legend of Shirley Bassey play their arrangement, history repeating. And, and the question I have, Jen, you talked about using an aircraft to attack. Do we know anything about how he was planning to get a hold of this aircraft, any of the small details? We do. In fact, um, we just went online. The word is about, there's something revolving. Wherever may come, the world keeps revolving. They say the next big thing is here. That the revolution's near. But to me, it seems quite clear that it's all just a little bit of history repeating. Uh, six uh, six uh, AK 47s, uh, assault rifles. He was planning, according to this FBI affidavit, he was planning uh, to attack with six other people. He is a U.S. citizen. Um, he's now been charged with trying to attack the Pentagon and U.S. Capitol Trace. Developments have seen the jazz world split in two by a new wave of musicians calling themselves disc jockeys. Those in favor describe the phenomena as a fresh rush of blood in the aging corpse of music. Those against prefer the term Emperor's New Clothes. Planning to get a hold of this aircraft, any of the small details? AK 47s, uh, assault rifles. He was planning, according to this FBI affidavit, he was planning um, to attack with six other people. He is a U.S. citizen. Um, he's now been charged with trying to attack the Pentagon and U.S. Capitol. Yeah. out that there was a 26-year-old Ashland, Massachusetts resident. He was a student, a graduate of Northeastern University, a student of physics. Uh, his name, Rezwan Fardos, who was just charged and arrested by the FD FBI following an undercover sting operation. He was planning, we're told, uh, he's accused of planning to attack the Pentagon using a remote-controlled drone, packing it with C4 explosives, and trying also to attack the, the U.S. Capitol. Uh, he's just been arrested today. We have um, the we have what looks like the affidavit from the Justice Department. Uh, but again, this just coming in right now. And, and the question I have, Jen, you talked about using an aircraft to attack. Well, what can I say? It's different. <laughs> 